First on five, over the past several weeks, hundreds of you have brought in toy after toy to help our great toy drive. Well, today the toy drive came to a close for the eighth successful year. News 5 meteorologist Melissa Constanzer takes us through how thousands of toys get moving out of our studios onto Santa's sleigh at the Salvation Army. As the last trucks unloaded on a cold December morning, the toy center was filled with warmth. You could find noisy toys, bouncy toys, boxes of Barbies, and there was a mound. I mean, a mound. Oh my goodness, of stuffed animals. Baldwin EMC and Alabama State Troopers helped add toys in the final push. So we kind of get associated with things that are not so pleasant. So this is one time during the year we get to come out and uh, bring some toys and hopefully they go to a uh, good cause and bring Christmas to folks who may not have something otherwise. And when all the toys were in... It was time to start packing them up. I am just amazed by the generosity of our viewers and our partners. Uh, it is nothing short of a miracle. It's a big job packing up toys for each kid, but our own Bill Riles was up for the challenge. So this is the culmination of everything we work days for to make sure that uh, boys and girls have a great Christmas. So that's what we're doing. It's what it's all about. And it's kind of fun, too. Sometimes the job is best suited for the youngins. I also got a soccer ball because it may seem like it's something for a guy, but most girls do love sports. Parents also had a pretty good idea of how to fill the bags. There you Basketballs go. and footballs, board games, uh, something to, uh, you know, to spend the time on. Bugmaster has helped us all eight years. It's all systematic now, so everyone that's been involved in the past just knows what the needs to be done, and it's, it's running real smooth. And with all these toys, we needed help from a few truck companies to haul all the toys away. Aaron said they were happy to help. You know, it was just uh, Saturday, I was delivering a sofa up on the third floor, and you know, it's a lot easier doing this than doing that, but hey, we love doing our jobs.